Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to our new video. I am Kobe and today we're going to be talking about how I had been here for four months already. Welcome to our channel. We are the Christ fam. Well, I mean, you're also part of the Christ fam, but you know, whatever. This is at least the Christ fam YouTube channel hosted by none other than us. So let's get started. Before we get started, if you will go ahead, as always, um, if you're not subscribed, if you go ahead and please click that subscribe button and click the bell to get notified when we release some more amazing videos. Also, I wanted to give a huge shout out to Joshua and his girlfriend, Isabel, for making an amazing song. It's called, As a Couple We Worship, and if you've not heard it, I would absolutely 110% recommend going and checking it out. Um, it's linked in our Instagram bio, which is at the underscore Christ underscore fam. So go ahead and check it out. Um, really worth the time. So. As a couple we worship you We adore you with all our hearts Break into this relationship Fill us with your unending get started guys I cannot believe I've been here for four months you know I, I remember you know it doesn't seem like that long ago where I was going and and I woke up I woke, got woken up at 7 in the morning by three amazing people uh, Lucas Simon and Joshua um, total surprise it was amazing it was awesome um, and you know I just I remember uh, getting you know saying goodbye to them at the airport and just knowing how difficult and how hard that was um, and just kind of looking back on it and the flow that I've gotten into um, of just work, it's gotten to be a good thing. You know, I'm really trying, it, it's hard, but I'm trying to grow my re relationship with Christ and um, I'm trying to be more devoted to him. I'm trying to be intentional with my relationships um, that, you know, I can't see every day, you know, whether that's um, talking to people on the phone, FaceTiming, texting, you know, Snapchatting, you know, really trying to be intentional and talk to people. Um, especially being far away, I know it's hard. It's really awesome too that every Friday I get together with a friend of mine who's also stationed at Ramstein, and we get to go over and just talk about life and it and our week, and it's it's a great way to connect and interact with um, someone that's not part of my job, you know. Uh, so it's been a really really positive thing, something that's been keeping me going, uh, making me you know chug along, I guess if you would say. Um, I don't know who says that, but you know. Uh, <laughs> It's looking like right now, um, I was at Main Shop for my first month and a half-ish here, month and a half, two months, give or take, uh, and I transitioned over to driving, which I, at first I was not too thrilled about, but now I can see, you know, it's not that bad, it really isn't, and I've gotten to learn a lot, and God has taught me a lot out there. It's looking like um, that I'm gonna be moving from driving back to main shop. That's a possibility, which would be really cool because I've missed main shop. Um, I definitely want, I really want to go back. Um, I know that if, you know, I don't get the chance to, I know that, um, you know, it's just not where I'm meant to be right now. Um, but it's, it'll be a great opportunity um, to kind of learn a couple more things than just do the thing I've been doing, which is driving for the past two, two and a half years, whatever the case may be. Um, because I've also driven, obviously, back at Ramstein. That's what I primarily did back there. So, yeah, it'll be a good change of pace, and I will really enjoy that. So I am really looking forward to that. I can't believe, you know, we're in the last week of May, and it's almost June, and I can even on a normal, even if I wasn't deployed, it's like, holy cow, how fast has this past five months gone, you know? Uh, we are almost in um, the sixth month of the year. We're almost halfway done with 2020. That's unimaginable um, it's 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 so insane to think about you know and you know in addition to it being so late in May it's getting hot it is getting pretty stinking hot it's I think the average high is about 40 41 degrees Celsius which is around about a hundred and two hundred and three um, I think one of the days it's supposed to be like 42 degrees so that's around 105 and from what I've gotten told, it can get up to like 120 something. 
um, and maybe even a little hotter than that, and I am not looking forward to that. I can tell you that right now. Uh, I step out of the truck, um, and my nice AC, you know, air conditioning truck, and I get out and I'm just hit with a wave of heat. And it's not fun at all. Like, at all. Um, so it's, you know, it's, it's something I'm getting used to. I'm definitely getting tan, which is amazing, but yeah. You know, last but not least, I'll end with this. As I've said in my videos, COVID-19 um, has affected all of us in, in crazy ways. Um, one thing that's a good thing that's come from it is that, you know, my church has gone online. And I'm so incredibly thankful for it that they do live streams uh, so that I still feel like I'm kind of part of it. You know, our young adults does a Zoom meeting afterwards and we'll get to just talk about the sermon, get to talk about life, how we're doing, that kind of thing. And it's been a really great encouragement to be able to have them there um, because it makes me um, engage more. So it's been really helpful, really, really helpful. So that's been a really great encouragement out here in Qatar. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you, again, go ahead and click on that subscribe button and click on the bell to get notified whenever we post some more videos. And we look forward to seeing you guys on the next video. See you guys.